Tristan Matthews and his best friend Jessica. Hi, friends. How are you? Hello. How are you? I'm good. Hey, I love yeah. you. I love you too. <laughs> so, Tristan, tell us now. What category are you nominated in today? I'm up for best escort and best, best? website escort website okay. today. Okay. Now that's the big one, the best escort yeah. category. Yeah. So how does it feel to be like? nominated to take home the big prize. I'm very excited and I really hope it's a very big award and not a little plaque and like not a little <laughs> shitty like thing. But I'm really excited even to be nominated, even to be recognized for the fact of what I do and what my like profession is and I'm very excited for it. That's wonderful. Now the website category, how much time do you put into your personal website like on a weekly basis? I honestly have to give you like a hundred percent truth. I do not put 100% into my website. It's a, basically a fan page and it's basically there for fans and I know I am probably not going to win that category and everybody up for it and I vote for Club Dean. I will even tell you right now Tristan Matthews will vote for Club Dean that he wins this, this fucking category because he is a very good person. His website is awesome, and I really love him, and he's hot, and I just hope he wins. <laughs> yes, he does definitely have a very, very hot website. And I see that you have a tattoo on your neck. Show the tattoo These of the lips. lips. Are they your lips? I have his on my butt. <laughs> <laughs> That's hot. If we weren't outside in public, I would totally ask to see that. Um, now, that's kind of like a trendy thing right now, the lips, because, you know, uh, another porn star, Chris Reynolds, has the lips tattoo on his neck, and Britney's got lips on her on her wrist. So, you know, do you feel like a trendsetter kind of with that? I feel like um, I did because I wanted to do it, and if it's a trendsetter thing, then let it be a trendset. A trend set, you know, like I don't know what to tell everybody. Like I'm excited to be here, and I'm excited to be at any event that has to do with porn or anything. And I'm excited to be like a trend center towards anybody who loves porn. So well, that's I, all I have to say. I think that's wonderful. <laughs> now you recently just shot for Hot House. What was yes, that like? Yes, I have. Well, I shot for Hot House Dark Room. It wasn't a big thing, but back um, room. I shot. I shot with the beautiful CJ Knight. He's actually right behind the camera right now. Where is he? CJ Knight? Can I get him up here? He's right up here. CJ, get up here. Hi, sugar. I want CJ up here. Can you get him up here? Just hop over, baby. Just hop over. Come on. Just Actually, you know what? Come around. Come around right over here. Yes. we got a special guest star, CJ Knight. Hi, Mike Powers. How are you from England? Yes. Okay, this is CJ Knight, also from Hot House, and you guys just did a scene together from yeah, the back room. Have. How was yeah. that? That's right. Um, it was good. It was good. Um, it was great. We had a good time. He's the most gorgeous human being I've ever seen in my life. Oh, thank you. <laughs> um, so, <laughs> he is filling out a um, restraining order as we speak. <laughs> Okay, now we're going to move over to Jessica. So Jessica, now if you've been following any of my adventures on YouTube or Google, you would know that I adore Miss Jessica. And I just love to say her name. Jessica! Jessica! Jessica. Because, and it's a little bit, it's not really an inside joke. Oh my. But if you ever watch Mad TV, Nicole Parker does Kristen Cavallari on Laguna Beach and it's called Laguna Biatch. And she always calling Jessica, Jessica! Jessica! Jessica, I totally cheated on all my boyfriends, so I know he's cheating on you, Jessica. Okay, Jessica, no, Jessica. I would cheat on my boyfriend with you, Angel. Ah! <laughs> wow. Now, I'm going to talk to you because they're busy right now. Um, <laughs> Obviously. Yes. <laughs> Ow. Uh, all the porn stars that live in San Diego are a little bit, I don't know, a little more crazy than the ones that live. And well, like, per capita, there's more craziers in San Diego than there is in L.A. What's that about? I don't know. I don't really know many besides Tristan and that live in San Diego. Like, if I go on set with them or, like, I know Brant Moore and I know Jaden. Mm -hmm. I know them, but that's about it. Like, if we go to, like, Do you know Rick Horgan? Yeah. Actually, we saw him. We were at a bar in Hillcrest. He was really nice. He bought me a drink. He's very sweet. Very yeah. sweet kid. Very underage in, the t in a bar. <laughs> You know, there's an old showbiz adage, never work with children or animals, but I think you might, um, you know, add, you know, voracious power bottoms to that mix as well, yeah, maybe you right? Add, maybe you right? Yes. 
Oh, and those are my glasses. Oh, I feel like Velma from Scooby-Doo. I can't find my glasses.